Hi there, this is Lee Time channel and here today we are going to talk about four common mistakes you probably made when you try to charge your lithium battery. Incorrect charging may lead to battery damage or even more serious problems. For those who are new to off-grid lifestyle, it's necessary for you guys to know how to charge the battery for long-term use. Be safe, then enjoy your trip. First, low temperature charge. Charging below 0 degrees Celsius can cause the lithium in the cell to freeze, blocking the flow of current. This may lead to a loss of battery capacity and increase the risk of short circuit. Aiming at solving this problem, Lithium developed low temperature cutoff and self-heating technology. Low temperature cutoff protection can automatically stop charging in cold weather. What's more, Lithium self-heating technology can heat the cells from minus 20 degrees Celsius to 10 degrees Celsius. But if your lithium battery doesn't have these features, it's better for you to stop charging the battery when the temperature is lower than 0 degrees Celsius. Second, charging lithium batteries with lead acid battery chargers. Lead acid and lithium batteries operate on different voltage ranges and chemical reactions, so their charging modes are different. Using a lead acid battery charger will make lithium batteries unable to get fully charged. What's worse, it may damage the battery management system called BMS. Third, using chargers with incompatible voltages. One common mistake is using low voltage chargers for high voltage batteries. For example, a 12 volt battery charger can supply enough voltage to charge 24 volt or higher voltage batteries. It will cause the battery unable to charge normally. Conversely, using high voltage chargers for low voltage batteries, the chargers for 24 volt or higher voltage battery cannot charge 12 volt batteries because the BMS will detect it and cut off the charging process. Therefore, using a charger that matches the battery voltage is crucial. Last but not least, loose screws in battery terminal and poorly connected alligator clips. It may lead to overheating and melt the battery terminals or even result in circuits not working properly. Therefore, the batteries are unable to charge or discharge normally. If you are using alligator clips, make sure to check the amper rating of the charging current. We do not recommend them using for currents exceeding 20 amper since it may result in overheating. If you are connecting wire lug to terminals, tighten the screw with torque wrench and adding additional washers to the screw if necessary to ensure a secure connection. So that's the four common mistakes of charging the lithium batteries. Go and see if you are charging your lithium batteries with the right way. Stay charged, stay safe and subscribe us and leave a comment. Let us know if you want to know more about solar power system.